Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is Proverbs 212. Proverb today is, uh, shrewd is the one that has seen calamity uh, and proceeds to conceal himself. Okay, let's take a look at the note here. So the proverb basically means that an intelligent or clever person, this is what we mean by shrewd, a person who is shrewd, uh, is the one who thinks ahead, thinks into the future. Uh, the type of person who will take action to protect himself or herself from danger. So, you know, looking at the proverb again, shrewd is the one that has seen calamity, you know, danger or possible destruction, and proceeds, you know, goes uh, to con conceal or hide himself from it. Uh, let's continue. Uh, the origin comes from a Bible quote. Uh, here is the one from the King James Version 22.3. A prudent, you know, somebody who's very good at judging things, a prudent man foreseeth, foreseeth, you know, it's old English, you know, to like see into the future, you foresee something, uh, foreseeth the evil, uh, and hideth, hideth, you know, it was an old form of just hide, basically hide himself. But the simple, simple meaning like simple people in general, pass on and are punished. So the simple pay no attention, they don't know what's going on, and they just end up falling victim to something. All right, number, uh, let's continue here. The proverb from the Bible tries to encourage people to be shrewd by looking ahead and by looking out for possible future danger. When one sees danger, uh, he is not uh, just supposed to wait for it to arrive or happen. A shrewd man will try to guard himself from it or try to sidestep it, you know, get out of the way of it. Okay, good. Calamity can come in many forms. You know, danger or destruction can come in many forms. Uh, for years, the media mocked, you know, they made fun of preppers uh, as crazy people. But they were the ones who saw danger or could foresee possible danger coming in the future and prepared. You know, the same thing you could think of like with the Bible and Noah. You know, uh, when Noah was supposedly building that ark, you know, if you go back to the that story, if you believe that story is, was real, uh, Noah was preparing for that great flood that was coming, and a lot of people in his day mocked him, made fun of him, oh, there's Noah in his crazy big boat, uh, you know, so that, that was another example. All right, let's continue. Uh, anytime a natural disaster struck, or more recently, you know, like the coronavirus, uh, they were the ones uh, which, who, were who were much more prepared than others. Okay. There are many areas of life in which one should try to look ahead with medical matters or, or avoidance of bad habits that could other, lead to other problems for you, not only your health, but other things in your life. Uh, ability to be self-reliant so that you may not have to depend on people. Because when emergencies happen, maybe those people also have emergencies and they may not, you may not be able to depend on those people either. Uh, okay, anyway, we just give a few um, questions here that some maybe somebody could answer this proverb too. So if somebody might say, why do you put so much money away for retirement? Or why do you put so much money away for a rainy day? Rainy day is like emergency. And you say, shrewd is the one that has seen calamity and proceeds to conceal himself. Uh, you could say that. Or, you know, we have other ones here. Why do you put so much... Um, Time and energy into exercise. Again, you could answer the same thing. Why do you put so much uh, time researching about your investments? And, you know, again, you could say shrewd or, you know, very intelligent, smart, is the one that's seen calamity and proceeds to uh, conceal himself or hide himself, get out of the way of it. Okay, anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it's food for thought. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.